My story begins six generations ago when my ancestors push west and homestead in Kansas. I grew up here. It's my home. Well, my dad was stationed at Andrews Air Force Base, and we visited monuments and memorials. I was so grateful and proud that we lived in America. We even got to visit the White House, and Ronald Reagan was the president. And when he spoke about the shining city on a hill, I felt like he was talking about Topeka. I was inspired and to serve my country, and so after graduating Topeka West, I joined the Army. After 9-11, my service was about up, so I volunteered to go to Afghanistan. And then I went on to support the U.S. efforts overseas as a civilian, developing local economies and safeguarding taxpayer money. At one point, I led 470 men and women on the front lines of Iraq. I mean, these teams were so diverse, different cultures and religions and races, all coming together to serve the common good. It makes the political fights in Washington seem petty. The war, it's not just bravery and sacrifice. It's about teamwork despite the differences. Leaders must bring people together. And that's what I did. So after service, uh, my friends were dealing with some of the same issues that I was. So I told them not to make themselves the victims, take ownership and keep challenging themselves. So I took my own advice and I uh, completed the Iditarod and then took my frostbit feet up Mount Everest. In war, I saw the lives of brave men and women end violently as they were trying to make the world a better place. I don't need to wonder what they would have me do. I've come home, I've come home to serve. And these lifelong politicians in Washington letting us down on healthcare, immigration, veteran services, especially PTSD. These are life and death issues that matter to Kansans. And these DC folks, they can't get over themselves. They can't come together, they can't get something done. It's time for some conservative Kansas values and some army leadership on Capitol Hill. I hope to make them proud as their congressman. I won't let them down. I'm Steve Watkins from Topeka, and I'm running for Congress.